Let us do this. Worship confessional number one. One. Eleven. Worship confessional number eleven. It's a hot dog today here in the Temecula Valley. And worship was hot today. Can you do your impersonation of the lady on that? So you can hear us? <laughs> you got a ticket on the hot tamale train! Woo! This is gonna be a good one. <laughs> I could be Nigel. But that was amazing! <laughs> Excellent worship today! Um, anyway, for me personally, uh, it was uh, it was great. I mean, I, I enjoyed it. Um, we had two acoustic guitars. We had me on acoustic, and we had Rob Koblenz who rocks. And um, we had Jennifer on vocals, me on vocals, and uh, Bill, uh, the new guy on bass, uh, Rich on drums, and it was great. Uh, we both used dinners today. How'd you like them? Good. A little hard to get used to. I love, 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 love my in-ears. I'm using E3s, and they're not the best, but they, uh, they fit in my ear, and I can hear exactly what I want, and I can turn down exactly what I don't want to hear. And they're perfect to tell jokes. And yes, Chris makes me laugh on stage. I love it. So um, anyway, we uh, opened up with um, Not To Us, which I think um, was good. Our church is getting that song. I like it. I really like the bridge part, um, which I can't even remember the words right now, but it's good. Uh, the earth is shaking. Jennifer keeps looking off camera. Sorry. Well, that's good to hear. Hey, can you come say that on camera? <laughs> She's like, yeah. Hey, is Jono's foot okay? Nah, go ahead. All right. What happened? And then, Rachel, you're tonsilless now? All right. That was our pastor's wife. She loved our worship. Maybe I'm getting a raise. <laughs> I hope, I hope. Uh, anyway, um, Woo! yeah. Hot tamale train. <laughs> Excellent worship. Okay. Um, <laughs> I know. Okay, so after Not To Us, uh, we, we, we did a little welcome and greet and hug time. And then right after that, we did uh, Sorry. We did No Other Name, a Todd Field song. Um, I love that song. I think we did a good job of it today. Actually, this is really weird because... Since um, I'm using in-ears, there's crazy kids I don't even know who they are. Um, since I'm using in-ears, I don't know what the house sounds like. So I have no idea if it sounded good or not. But it sounded good in my ears. I'm leaving the rest up to Chris and his team back there of sound engineers. Um, Your house mic's for Yeah. Anyway, uh, so then we did uh, the Todd Field song. Great. I really liked it. Um, our band, I think, did okay with it. Uh, not, not as tight as we could do it, obviously, but I think we did pretty good. And then it was so cool because after Jesus, Jesus, name above all names, we, we kind of did an acapella version of that. And then, boom, last line of the last lyric of the last line, um, Rob comes in, everlasting God. It was great. And then uh, Rich came in on the drums. Cracked. And he just did that the whole song. And it just I love it when he does that because it was good. So uh, that was everlasting God. Anything on that one? No, good. This week, I think the church was digging it. Um, last week, they were having a problem. I, I don't know. Last week was awkward. This week, mm -hmm. they dug that song. Um, and then Jen did um, Give Me Jesus, the Jeremy Camp song, which she just freaking tore up. Oh, thanks. Second was service was awesome. Second service was awesome. Like, awesome. Uh, it was great. I mean, uh, she had a really good acoustic guitar player backing her up. <laughs> and, um, and I thought it was really cool. I had the whole band go down, and so it was just me and her. And you want to say anything about that song? No, nope, it was good. Yeah, it was good. Um, people came up and just, they said that it was making them cry and, you know, all that kind of stuff. So, you know, that's always good when you can make people cry. Um, and then, uh, and then you know, from a technical aspect, I'm sure Chris and Chuck will probably give you some, some tidbits on that. Um, they had a rough time today, and, and I apologize because a lot of it was my fault because I have crazy ideas. Um, but the flow of service, man... It was kind of wacky today again. We really got to work on that. Uh, it was just like it was like wheel and deal time. It was like it was like it was like the Price is Right first service. Come on down! <laughs> and it was just like oh my gosh, it was Bob Barker up there. Um, Where? Second service was a little better. Um, a little awkward closing because John showed a video and there was really no follow up for it. But um, and, and I hope they took offering today. 
because uh, I didn't see that happen. But um, uh, then we closed with Closer, which is a good closer of a song. I just got to show you what Chuck's doing right now. He's been doing this the whole time. We call him uh, a Mac MacBook Pro holder. protection holder. <laughs> anyway, um, he's omnipresent. There's James up on the uh, up on the ladder there. Uh, Closer, which I thought was very, I, I really like that song. I think it's pretty deep and uh, passionate. And uh, our harmony worked really well on that one. Mm -hmm. Generally like the harmony on that one. And Wanna you could, hear it? Um, we could try. I thought someone wanted to sing there, it. There, there, there. I got my guitar right there. <clears throat> um, Chuck's getting my guitar. He's also a guitar getter. Okay, so we went like getter. this. Look, we went in the key of B flat, and I got my suicide strings. You right didn't here. know what key you played in. Uh, and then we went on this part and we go. Ready? Power of your word, fill with grace and mercy, and let them fall on my ears. <laughs> well, that was horrible. <laughs> it was better than that. <laughs> we like that song. I think the church Coming likes that song. And, uh, I, did, I think I hit a pretty gnarly note in that song, Second Service. That's yep. what Chris said in my ears, which is always good. So uh, it was a good day here at Life Church. Uh, we had all kinds of stuff. We had a few baptisms after church. That's always great. Um, it's just crazy. Um, now we got to tear this all down again, and uh, only for maybe eight or ten more weeks. We're really excited, and uh, I'm just stoked. Uh, I'm going to give a shout-out to Billy Chia. What's up, my man? Thanks for putting me on your blog. I feel really special. And uh, I will talk with you all later. Oh. And don't forget, get your pet spayed or neutered. <laughs> that was great. <laughs>